Hey YouTube, what is up everybody? How's it going? This is your own boy, Seven Thong. For, I am not a morning person. I never have been. I never will be. But since I work a job, um, I gotta get up early in the morning. I, I think my job is kind of toying with me in a way. And because it's like... You know, they had me do one thing for a while, and then they'll train me to, they'll tell me to train somebody else on my department, and then it's like, why, you know, it's like, why do they need to train me to train somebody else when they're not going to me around, and which, you know, I'm tired of training people at my job, because, you know, I look at it this way, that's supposed to be the manager's job. To train, to train the people, not the employer, not not the employee. You know that that's the thing. You know, most companies would have better have the employee train them, the employee to train them, their new ones, and whatever the line there is, or Whatever work area that are at, whatever you want to call it, line, work area, stuff like that. And that's the thing, you know, um, it shouldn't be like that in all companies, you know. All companies are the same way, you know. They'll get some newbies in, they'll be like, they'll say, yo, Bill, or Bob, or whoever, you know, that's out on the floor. And, you know, they're just a regular employee. They'll say, I want you to train them. I want to say, well, shouldn't that be either your job or a manager's job? You know, that's what I want to tell people. Because, you know, it shouldn't really be my job to train people. Because, um, because if something falls wrong on them, well... They get turn around and say, well, he's the one that trained me. Well, then I could be the one getting in trouble. So, it's like, it's like a double-edged sword. It's like, they're baiting me to either one get in trouble, or two, they're baiting me to train people. And it's like, it's like a double-edged sword. And... Which, I don't think it should be my job. I, I think it should be a manager's job to train somebody. But, they say managers don't have time. Managers got all the time in the fucking world. All they do is sit on their asses all day. You know, bosses get sit on their asses all day. And everything. Or whatever. Or, standing around in one spot talking for a whole fucking hour. And everything. And. You know. When did it don't have the time to do shit? You know. It's like. Because they don't want to take the time. To train somebody new. Themselves. Because they don't want to deal with it. They don't, they say, oh, we don't have time, I don't have time to train people and all that, you know, so they would have a employee train them, well, if a employee trains them, if something goes wrong with that employee that does wrong, well, they'll say, well, so-and-so told me how to train them, so-and-so taught me on how to do this, and, and I'm like, well, that ain't right, you know, that's like, like I said, it's like a double-edged sword. You know, it's like... You know, it's like you don't know which way you're going to get cut. Cut with a double-edged sword. Because it could either, one, be a good, good way of slicing, and another way, it could be a bad way of slicing. You know, you never know. So, that's the reason why I always think... 
when it comes to running a business, this is how I see it. When it comes to running a business, one, the managers got to train people. Managers got to train people. Not the employees. Two, the bosses ought to care about their employers. You know, common sense. You know, they're doing all the work for you. You know, they're doing all the work for you. You know, you should care about your employers. You know, that's one thing that's keeping your business alive. It's because without your employers, your business would be nothing. Because your employers are what brings the company make company up and moving. Your employers are what brings the customers coming back. So if you're running a business or if you're running a customer service thing, number one, always treat your customers right. Two, always treat your employers right. No matter what you do in, in your business, always treat your employers right. Because if you don't treat your employers right, you're never going to get anywhere. Peace.